Okay, so we all know that the finale of the Real Housewives of Lagos was about the fight between Caroline and Choma. After the whole show, Caroline had to tweet this. I gave you my all, but before we dive right in, hello, trending gist lovers, welcome back to my channel. I mean, your girl Octavia Cora. Now, if you enjoy gist like this, then don't forget to subscribe, okay, and turn on your notification bell so we can dissect and analyze together. Now, before we even start anything, let me say kudos to all six ladies. They did fantastic on the show. They never disappointed. They all knew what they had to do and they all delivered although some persons are taking it kind of personal do not do that because this is a reality tv show if there's no drama if there's no um different characters and all of that it wouldn't be called a reality tv show and there will not be fun and the rating will be down that will be the end of the show. So the ladies did good kudos to each and every one of you. You delivered on this season one. We're expecting more in season two. But anyway, let's get into what uh, Caroline tweeted. Okay, so Caroline said, I gave you my all. I loved, tolerated so much, stood up for myself, apologized when I was wrong. To those who love me, thank you for your support. To those who criticized me, thank you. I am still learning. Lots of love, enjoyment, Minister HRM Caroline. Hashtag Roa Lagos with a heart emoji. Now, this is what she had to say. She said a whole lot because if you watch this last episode, okay, then you know that the fight between Caroline and Choma was not even necessary. But Choma was trying to play, you know, the good girl game, trying to be in the good books of all the other ladies, seeing that her friendship with Caroline is no longer something that she could uh, hold on to. She wanted to quickly lash on to someone else before the friendship completely falls apart. And you can see that play out because when she started bashing Caroline, calling Caroline different type of names, when Caroline fired back and all of that, and also insulted Choma's family immediately, Immediately, Iyabo and Tiana jumped in in the middle like, nah, 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 nah. We're not going to have you do that. Don't bring in her family. Say whatever you want to say to her, but don't bring in her family. Iyabo was even pointing at Caroline. I was like, I'm going to get upset with you. I'm going to get upset with you if you do that. I'm going to get mad at you. Like, she really wanted to also fight. Now, remember, what caused this whole fight was even because of Iyabo, okay? Because Caroline had attacked Iyabo when Iyabo came into she and Choma's room when she she was upset with the team okay the producers and people responsible for the reality tv show the real housewives of lagos she had asked for food and they did not pay attention to her according to her she said they ignored her they acted like she didn't matter so that really made her very upset and not even not that alone in her confessional caroline had actually said that they gave her and choma the same one room that they had to share a room that she needed her privacy and all of that so that was already so many things was just making caroline upset so when uh, iyabo came into the room to say good night i'm going to my room i'm going to my place that even made her more mad and she lashed out at iyabo complete transfer of aggression okay iyabo was not responsible for whatever was happening to her but that was just someone that she felt like she could transfer everything to at the moment the person that was available and that's what that was what she did now chama didn't support the fact that she was doing that knowing fully well that every time laura tiana uh, miriam or any other person says something she will always go and so yeah iyabo was someone that will always go to caroline and chama uh, tell them what the other lady said about them or whatsoever that will later cause war. So Iyabo was playing the card of being on the good book. So I think that was why Choma felt like I have to defend her. Let me know what you think in the